What's going on guys, it is Nicolad Gamer, and today for you guys I'm here with another episode of our Earthbound playthrough. In the last episode, we made it to Foresight, we did a little bit of exploration there, and we found this little spot here, I forget exactly what it's called, but the Runaway 5 uh, were here as well, and they had to pay off on a million dollar debt, and we saw their show, now let's go in here and see what's happening in here. So helpless, really helpless and hopeless. Yuck, yuck, yuck. <laughs> Again, we've been cheated by the theater owner. We're stuck in here with a phony contract. Oh, yeah. Oh, are they just saying the same thing? Okay, so they're doing, they're saying the same thing. So it looks like we're going to have to do the same thing with... Oh, we're seeing the show again. I have to see this and... Yep, okay. So, maybe the do, the... do these people talk? Can I talk to these people? No. Sitting peacefully. Alright. So it looks like there's nobody here that can help us, but we do need to pay off that debt somehow. And... When we found the wad of uh, bucks, I think that's what it was before. Um, let's see, will you, will you say anything new? What? Excuse me? No, no. This man owes me a million bucks. If they break their contract, they'll be in deep doo-doo with the police. The police will probably say, hey, you guys, or something like that, unless you're able to pay a million dollars on their behalf. You'll have to find buried gold, or you'll never be able to pay such a huge sum of money. Ho, 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 okay. So, this is going to suck, but I think what we're supposed to do is go to Pokey, Pikey, Porky, Pookey, Pelugey, whatever. I forget what the building's called, but we're gonna have to ask him for the money. At least that's the itch I'm getting because he's he's has so much money. Monotoli, that's what it is. I just I just remember, but I really don't want to have to do that because he's been he's been such like a, a like a terrible person that I feel like if we were to go ask him for money. He'd be like, oh, you want my support now? Let me just fast forward this whole thing. Alright. Help me out here. Ooh la la. This is my poor... Okay, so you're gonna say the same thing. Oh, didn't, didn't you come here to back for something? Ooh la la. Don't you... I'm Master Puggy. Get down. Gildery Monotoli's partner. And I give him political and economic advice. I heard there were some ratty looking kids asking for Mr. Montoli, was that you, Ness? This isn't a place where he likes you. Get out of here. Okay, so it's the same thing. I don't know if his dad's going to. His dad's been, was, well, he's been pretty rude, too. I'm, okay. So we can't ask them for money. So what do we do? Oopsie. You. So can we maybe... What about you guys? I'm a lead businessman who works in Mr. Montoli's office. Alright, so... Hmm. You have 22,000 bucks. That's not gonna get us anything. Can we get into the department store now? So that's, okay, good thing I actually listened to that. That's the sound of when a year's sanctuary location goes through. So I'm assuming we're supposed to find the next year's sanctuary location. Well, let's just 
Oopsie. For now, let's just look around. See, that's not good. Jeff died. Are you kidding me? Hmm. So, um, and I don't know if you guys are hearing a little bit of banging. Oh, there's the hint guy. I'll ask him. Um, I don't know if you guys are hearing any banging. There is something going on. Uh, in my house, but I needed to record, and and we all died. Good thing we saved there. I gotta go get to the hospital now. Oh, uh, we have to go to a hotel and everything. Jeez, where's the hospital at? All the way in the corner. A hundred and fifty, like it gets just more and more expensive. And the hotel is at the bottom. Close by to the hint guy, so we'll ask the hint guy after we're done with that. A couple of things. I should probably stop getting into this fast forward thing. Probably stop getting into that habit. There you are, buddy. In the middle of Dusty Dunes Desert, there's someone who's starving. I just sent. I just sense it. That's it for today. Okay, so where I, where I was like, oh, all those cars are gone now, there has to be something going on then, that somebody's starving. I don't understand it, though. Okay, I do have to get back on the fast forward, though, to just get over there. I apologize for that. This fast forward desert music. Oh my gosh, I love it. Yeah, see? All those cars are gone now that I got out of there. I don't like that at all. There is someone who is starving. Oh my. Yeah, at this point, I just need to find this guy. Cup of life noodles. Hold on. There's a bag of fries in here. Jeff can eat that bag of fries. Cup of life noodles. Does that? Please tell me that revives. Hold on. Oh my gosh. Thank goodness. Oh wait, he has sunstroke. Hold on. Another little double burger. This one struck again. 
Is that a mini Earth Sanctuary location? A set of contact lenses. Okay, so let's use healing again, looks like, because there's only been like five minutes. Then, what does Double Burger do? 90 HP. And Paula has, so I'm just going to have to keep healing these people. Okay, so I don't need to worry about that present for now. Oh my god, what are you doing here? Oh. I'm gonna go back up there in a second. Who are you? Who, you have sunstroke again. Can we give him food now? Wanna skip sandwich deluxe? Dang it. No, then I have to get out of fast forward. I hate this. I don't know why I'm doing it. Okay, so we're in here now. And he asked for food. Oh, wait, so that was the guy who was starving. Oh my god, I wasn't even paying attention. So he was starving. He, was, he, he asked for food. I gave him the skip sandwich deluxe, even though we probably should have used it ourselves. He's gone. Hmm. Get in here. Oh. I think we have to go back to the hint guy and ask him what to do. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't have a problem digging until this. I found a maze. Lots of, mo lots of monsters appeared, so I couldn't proceed. There's five big moles. If I beat the monsters, I can continue on. I think I have a bleeding ulcer from worrying too mo much. I'm helpless to really do anything. Not when we're around. Because that's video game logic. Wait, what's over here? Is this another passage, or is this like a treasure chest or something? No, they're monsters, but you know what? I'm gonna fight them. Noose man. All right. Perfect. Oh, he didn't. He didn't run away from me. Oh, it's a dis if it's a different kind of snake. That's why. Level thirty-four, Jeff. Okay, all my um, people will be gone by then. So, I keep hitting the L button again, I apologize. How am I going to get away from all these, or like get through this place without fighting? Because I feel like 
I'm not doing enough. A chick? Yeah, I don't need to worry about the big bo Actually, no, I might want to worry about that big bottle rocket. What is this chick? Chick that just hatched. Seeing chicks makes you happy. So what, what does happiness do? This game is so out of the ordinary. It's, the chick makes you happy. What does the chick do? What is that spider? Gigantic ant. Kind of looks like the enemy from the Year Sanctuary location. There we go. That is a lot of XP though. Good lord. Oh, who are you guys? Please take my son along. He may look like a regular small mouse, but he can lead you to an exit if you're lost in a maze. Take one of my sons along. You have too many items. You can't take my son. When your son is an item. Okay. IQ capsule. Let's use it right now. On Paula. Oh, that. Okay, whatever. Um, let's just... No breaks. Alright. Let's keep looking at stuff that we can use. Horn of life. Let's keep that... Uh, in check. Insecticide spray? No. Defense spray. Uh, has to be used in battle. There's a picnic lunch inside. The picnic lunch is gonna be used on me to max out my HP. Oopsie. And then you... Oh wait, no, I have room again. Croissant inside. Alright, so now I'm going to take the croissant away from Paula. And give it... To Jeff. Oh my god, I thought he had more HP than that. I just wasted it. Whatever. But the exit mouse... So now, how do I know that he's leading me to an exit? Hold on. I apologize. I just gotta keep this and fast forward for this stuff. No, that's fine. I don't have to worry about a bomb. Whoa, that's a lot of stuff. And it kills Jeff. Why am I not surprised? Didn't the Horn of Life revive? Oh, I can't use it because Paula's not there. But I can give it to Ness. What do I do? I'm gonna have to die then. I'm gonna have to do what I can before I die, though. Whoa, 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 whoa! I'm one of the masters of this hole. There are five masters in all. We are all moles, of course. I believe I'm the third strongest amongst us. Take your best shot. So there's five bosses in here? I 
I can't even attack. Yeah, okay, so I died. Yeah, okay. We'll figure something out. We'll get you out of here. I have to go back to the hospital. I have to go back and pay. How much money do I have? Enough. I have to go. I have to pay the expenses to heal them again. Like always. It's basically how, like, every episode goes. Oopsie. Alright, there we go. So I'm assuming this exit mouse that we have is actually going to work as an escape rope in this game. Where it's kind of like... I don't know why I did that. Oh, because I have to go back to the hotel. Thanks for reminding me, butterfly. Not to the hospital, hotel. But I think we have to go fight those in order because like they're, it raises their power each time, each number. So I have to find the number five first because he's the fifth strongest, the number four, then three, then two, then one. However, we are slowly reaching a time to end off this episode. So thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed this episode i'm not forcing you to but leaving a like does always let me know that you guys are enjoying this playthrough and let me know what you guys want to see in the future as always i will see you in the next video goodbye